We have developing news. A Charleston County man in jail accused of leaving the scene of a deadly hit and run accident last week. Herbert Fielding was arrested this morning, then appeared in bond court this afternoon. News News Riley Benson joins us live from the Yale Cannon Detention Center with the latest. Riley. Yeah, Brendan, a Charleston County judge set a $100,000 surety bond for Fielding, who's accused of striking and killing Raul Perez on Sam Rittenberg Boulevard last Wednesday night before fleeing that scene. Now, Fielding, whose family owns Fielding's Homes for Funerals, unsuccessfully ran for the Charleston County Corner back in 2020. He has been in trouble with law before. He was charged with a DUI back in 2013. Now, witnesses say Fielding was traveling north in a dark-colored Equinox when he struck the victim. He then pulled over and checked his car for damage in an affidavit the next morning. Fielding was overheard on a phone call by CPD investigators and officers saying he believed he hit a curb or a box, but not a person. A victim advocate was in court today and read three statements from the family members of that victim. What kind of man does this? My brother was not an animal. He was not a deer. He was not a box or a bag of trash at the side of the road. Raul Perez was a kind and gentle soul who was removed from this world by the accused Mr. Fielding. I am struggling to come to terms with this reality that Raul was killed by a man who didn't even stop to check on him. Now, some family members of Fielding, along with his attorneys, declined to provide a comment or statement following today's bond hearing here at the Al Cannon Detention Center. For now, reporting live in North Charleston, Raleigh Benson, Count on Two.